Good morning, my name is Kim Carlisle, and we have a shop full of Heise glassware. We're located just north of Indianapolis, Indiana, and our shop is open at this time by appointment. You might get a pencil and paper handy. I'm gonna show you our email address in just a minute. This morning's video is gonna be a little bit different. Starting today at 8 a.m., we are going to show you a video of items in one case that is going to be going with us to Heise Convention this year in June. If you see anything you're interested in, in the case, all you have to do is call, text, or email, and we'll sell it to you before we actually take it to a convention. So if you're ready, I'm gonna show you our email address in case you don't have our phone number. You can call us and get it. My name is Kim Carlisle. The letter email address is the letter K, C-A-R-L-I-S-L, -S at A-T-T -T dot N-E-T. So like I say, every day for about the next two weeks, we're gonna be showing you a video of what's in one case or what's on a table. So let's get started this morning with case number one. Here we are at day number three, case number three. Case number three, top left-hand corner, we have an old sandwich crut and flamingo, old sandwich wine and flamingo, Marshall cocktail shaker with a ram's head stopper, Benson and Hedges moon gleam tobacco jar, a pair of flamingo salt and pepper shakers, high low vase in cobalt blue, limelight Madonna, she is marked on the back, locket on a chain cruet, and a baby swan or a signet. Second shelf, we have a bonnet basket with a wonderful bird and water scene cutting on it. Octagon number 500 basket, nice cutting. Same basket and moon lane with a cornflower cutting. A pair of Ipswich candelabra with cobalt blue inserts. Vaseline wing scroll berry bowl. Warwick horn of plenty individual candle holder. Two little piglets, one sitting, one standing. A hawthorn mayonnaise ladle. Little yeoman cologne with a cutting, long dripper. Twist Moongleam Ice Bucket, three cordials, two Jamestown, one with Narcissus Cutting, one with Sheffield Cutting, and we have a, I believe that's an Oxford Cordial with a Galway Cutting on it. Glen Crut, Windsor Cutting. Have a Prism Band Decanter, and four shot glasses, those were marked in Flamingo. Here's a very nice Oxford cutting with a very, very fancy cutting. Duck Flamingo ashtray, banded flute matchbox, footed colonial crushed fruit, pair of Wellington candle holders in Flamingo, Revere candy box, Windsor cutting, Ridgely pressed water pitcher, two colognes, a large one and a small one, both with Windsor cutting, four shelf. We have a plantation cruet with a cutting around it. This plantation cruet is a prototype. It never had the pineapples on it. 20th century dawn cream pitcher. We have three pieces out of the toy plain band set. We have the butter dish, the creamer, and the spooner. A plantation three-part relish, pair of Ridgely candelabra, raindrop water pitcher, four different Sahara favor vases, bottom shelf, pair of Old Roysburg, I think they're 10 half or 11 inch candle holders, a Revere, I'm sorry, this is a narrow flute with rim basket with barberry, barberry etching, six inch Puritan cigarette box with a horse head finial, have a footed Waverly Bowl Orchid Etch. Another Puritan cigarette box, six inch again. Pair of satellite candle holders. And a bead of swag syrup and opal with a decoration probably by Oriental Glass Company in Pittsburgh. That concludes the video for the day. If you see anything you're interested in, you can call, text, or email. And we'll see you tomorrow for case number four.